I'm going to be making a picture of my dog, Max. He's kind of a light brown with curls. So, I guess we're going to do some brown. I'm practicing on this. So I make sure I get the color. That looks like about him, right? Mm -hmm. And then, maybe a little bit of white. That looks like kind of his color, but a little more his color. Well, I made a cardboard color, but it'll work. Normally you would trace him, but... Trying to make some curls on him. Okay, there's his kind of body. Just need to make a little. some curls. And now I'm gonna sense his legs are kind of brown but with a hint of white on the bottom of the paws. I'm gonna do a little bit more of that color I just did. Except it's gonna be all over the place. Now you can kind of see the dog hint. Kind of looks like a poop, but he is kind of a poop. Now we need to get some white on the bottoms. So dip the white in here. Has a little paint palette. You can use an actual palette, but I do. And then you can kind of see that white, but if you want to make it a little bit darker, you can add some black, but I'm not going to. Actually, I don't know. I'll add a little bit of white sparkles. This paws can sparkle. Now you can kind of see that sparkle. I'm gonna just Okay. And then the hay is just like that. 
So I'm going to trace it out with some white. So I know where it's going. You can kind of see that line, but you not might be able to see it on the camera. Kind of see that little line. Could have traced it with pencil, but I'm not going to. And then I'm going to mark his little eyes. Kind of like a light, kind of like a dark green, I'm guessing. Yeah, let's say like a dark green with some sparkle. Okay, so now it's got some green for his eyes, because eyes are kind of a dark, dark green. So I am going to add some black to it. I'm going to kind of mix these. does make plenty of black, but kind of a grayish black as you can see, kind of like silver. So if it's too light, yes, you can add another. And now it is becoming more black, like a dark gray. So, but you, so I'm going to pause the video until I get the perfect color, but yes, you want to try to get a kind of, he has a little bit of sparkle black in his eyes, but I, I just took perfect color and I mixed it. So, I guess we're not going to pause it anymore. Okay, here, because you don't want the color too dark. So, I'll brush, oh, hey, there might be a little paint scratch in my mug. But okay. Uh oh, it's too watery. That's some. Um, a little too big. Okay, I use my finger to kind of wipe it. Don't do that. So I did mess it up, but I paused it to get it kind of fixed up. But you don't want to add so much. So I'm going to add a little, and then I'm just going to kind of wipe it. Again, that wiped away the green. I was not trying to do that. Okay, that's, that's darker than I hoped. So I'm going to add a little bit of green. So I got some green. That looks a little too dark. He is not blacked eye. Once I'm done, you'll kind of get a little hint of what he looks like. If not, I might put him in the comments below. Okay. Well, that turned out a little black. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Now, I'm guessing we should draw the face with brown. So, I forgot what the color looked like of oh, brown. I'm guessing we did brown and some white. Okay, so now we're going to get some brown, and I'm going to trace the head. Whoa, yeah, that's dark. Yeah, I'm going to mix some white with this. And then I'm going to try really hard. Color inside the lines. If you're a good color inside the lines, you should not be worrying about this. But sometimes I get out of the line, so... With painting, since my grandpa's an artist, Joel can, he makes me not, so I am pretty good. But I do have some white spaces. So I did draw his ear, because I forgot that he had floppy ears, because we had a little dark spot like that came out, so I just made the ear kind of long. Now I'm going to do the same thing with the other side. Well, since he has his head tilted, we're just going to draw the ear like that. Okay, that's a little long, but we'll make the other one a little long. Okay, so I poured a little black for his nose, because you know all dogs have like black noses. That's why I had that a little too dark, so I'm just going to kind of dab it in there. 
If it does turn out too watery, start over. Now, okay, that kind of a little too dark, not a little too light. So I'm gonna have a little bit more. This is kind of an abstract, because at the end we might show him if we have some time. Okay, now we're gonna do the little tail. And you can see that it does look dry, which it is. So that is perfect. I just touched the ear. See so yeah, how that is dry, so you can kind of see that color coming in. Okay, and then the tail is the same color as that. So if I can try to get the same color, it will be perfect. So if you remember, I said I was going to make the tail, so let's do that. I'm going to outline it in some white, and then we'll get started. This tail is kind of pointy and blocky. Again, I will show you. Let's just color in the whole thing with white because I did make the color with white. So let's just color in the whole thing with white. Oh, I got some on the counter. Daddy, that did not stay. Okay, now we're going to get some brown water. I hope it's not too water. Okay, that makes the perfect color. A little too dark up here, but Okay, never mix these colors with these. Always put the these ones last. Okay, well that's a little too fat. Kind of look like it kind of. Okay, now we're gonna be making the paws. So I did get some more so I can color in. There was a little speck and I don't want that. So I'm just making final touches. And then we're gonna do his toenails because I, my dad clearly forgot about it. Okay, now we just need some black, like three black spots for the toenails. To make the toenail color, it's kind of not, it was a little too dark when I just added some black. So I added a little bit of white. Okay, so this is what color it makes if you use my certain colors and add just enough. Kind of has a little sparkle, but that's okay. Okay, now let's wipe it off. More lot. And then some. And then we're just going to make tiny, tiny specks. Actually, I'm going to change brushes. Oh, this might have been the tiniest. Yep, this is the tiniest. just kind of try to draw the toenails. We possibly can. Okay, well that is Max. I'm going to label it even Max. <gasps> I don't know what I'm laughing about. Yeah, that's Max. But now let's get 